So, pretty cool. The build, the building so far, I kind of like it. I kind of wish they kept stuff from the old one. Not gonna lie. But um, turret tower designs, they're gonna be. I, I think they're gonna be looking something like this. At least the ones that I will be building will be something like this. Cause this, to me, it feels it feels clunky. I don't I don't like it at all. These beams have too much of a, a hitbox. And over this, these are a lot smaller and they take the same amount of rockets, you know? So there's no point. And can't a turret shoot through a fence? Um in the old one, not re kinda, not really. I don't know, I'd have to test it. That hits. That goes through. This it hits this, all of this, I think, has a hitbox. ARB is gonna go right through that. Probably, yeah. I wonder if rifles go through it as well. Yeah, oh my god. Shoot a rocket through the bottom of that. So like... That yeah, look right at that. It. Yeah, that would be amazing. That hits it right there. You have to hit the top of it, so that's almost harder than... I mean, it's, it's pretty much like a hatch frame, I guess. Yeah, almost. You, you need no, to be you, to you need to be within this right here to actually hit it. So there's that. So this was the first design I was thinking of with the with the um pillars, and then I was like looking around. I found the railings, and then uh, switched it up a little bit. Found out this kind it's kind of the same concept, but it has uh, supports going all the way down to the bottom around where the, I guess the generator would be. So it offers more support. And then in the middle of testing this, I found out that these pillars, if they're snapped to the foundation that's connected to the door frames, if the foundation gets blown, the pillars hold up the door frame on both sides. So they have to go through a foundation and two pillars if they want to drop this or they go straight for the door frame. Interesting. Yeah. Now where would the Jenny go for that though? It would be That's the other it would be in here really. Because we can't do vault drops, so it's either the generator is gonna be in this thing or you're gonna do what I did in this one and just leave it up here. This one, now this one's insane, dude. If they're going for a drop, they need to go through all of the double door frames in order to drop it. Because if they go for the foundations, this singular pillar is holding up all of this if the foundations get blown. I have a tester one over here. It's fine. Oh, okay. It's the same thing, but not as, as tall. Like, that'll still hold it, which I find insane. I definitely feel like these designs probably will start getting used because of the railings. They take the same amount of damage as those pillars would, and they're a lot smaller, and you have a lot more, um, I guess, options with the way you can move them. The only thing that does suck with them is that you can't really walk on them because you kind of slip off. So building turrets and placing them might be a pain. But I mean, the overall design of this, to me, seems cool, and I'm going to be implementing this into probably all of my towers that I build from now on for ASA. Because there's really nothing else that we can use. They took out the hatch frame, catwalks, there's ceilings left, the pillars. I mean, the pillar thing is kind of cool, but it's a pretty big target to hit. Also, the range for the generator on one of these towers is pretty insane. That's on, I think, the... That's on the sixth wall up. And it's still touching the floor, and it can go up even more. You can probably go another seven or eight walls up. That's another four rows of these turrets, which is pretty insane. So I'm going to show you guys how to build this tower if you want to set it up on a server. Let me know how it holds up.
I'm skipping every other door frame so I have enough space for upside down turrets. And you want to make sure to cap it off at the top so everything stays connected. The building for ASA is clean and there's a lot more customization for it. I like my design and I'm probably going to call it a 5G tower. It looks like one and it'll probably be killing birds like one. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of the tower and if you found anything else out we can use to make them better.